for us. If you haven't seen that sunrise out there, go take a look. It is beautiful this morning. We do have a few clouds kind of hanging around, and actually that's kind of helped our temperature a little bit this morning. It's not as cold as it has been. Right now, 36 in the metro, but you go west, that's where skies are clear, and that's where the temperatures, well, have tumbled into the teens and 20s again. Now, our view from our satellite perspective, really nowhere near as pretty as the view from ground level looking up at that sunrise with the clouds, but you do see the clouds with us. This is part of that little weak weather disturbance that we had alluded to kind of coming into the area. And this weather system, most of all, other than a few of these clouds this morning, will drive a little cold front in by way of the northeast plains a little later on today. Picking up some breezes here there, especially eastern half of the state and possibly dropping temperatures a couple of degrees. Most of your substantial temperature drops will be in the easternmost parts of the state. Then Saturday, we get a quick hitting weather system that goes north of us. But by Sunday night, Monday and Tuesday, this is where the computer models come together or don't come together, I guess you could say. They're at odds because most of the computer models have been saying even this system stays north of us. But look, I drew it further south here, right on into the northern half of the land of enchantment. That's because we have one outlying computer model run that says that thing comes south. Now, I'm not banking on that. But if it happens, we could actually have some active weather next week. So certainly next few days, this is something that we will be keeping a very, very close eye on. In the meantime, temperatures today really not showing a lot of change out in the western parts of the state. It's in the east where we're milder this morning because of clouds and cooler in the afternoon because of that particular cold front. But as you move on into the southern parts of the state, not seeing much in the way of cloud cover. And that cool front, if it does arrive... We'll be late getting there, so looking for 70s again down on those southeastern plains. Highs today, low to mid 80, uh, 50s, that is, across the East Mountain communities. And mid to upper 50s in the metro. Still think there will be a couple of locations where the temperature could scoot on up there into the lower 60s, especially as you head south on I-25. 52, my forecast high today in Santa Fe. few extra clouds to start the day, but going sunny by late afternoon. And sunshine and dry weather will carry us into the weekend in the metro. Temperature just shy of that elusive 60 degree mark and again next monday tuesday question marks surrounding which computer model will be right they should uh, have better consensus over the weekend and we'll of course let you know what to expect once we get a better handle on it okay great thanks a lot jason